When it comes to defending or supporting marginalized communities, few community leaders compare to the tireless efforts demonstrated by Kiev Tatum, pastor of the New Mount Rose Missionary Baptist Church, located in East Fort Worth. For the past several years, he has proven himself to be a fearless community leader, willing to extend himself whatever degree necessary to serve and support those in greatest need of our care and concern. As a member of the Fatherhood Coalition, organized in 1998 by Workforce Solutions, Pastor Tatum has been an ardent supporter of our activities, offering his church for fatherhood and community outreach events upon request. When discovering that Fatherhood Coalition was falling short of the goal for Christmas gift cards for low-income children this year, Pastor Tatum joined Workforce Board member Lily Biggins as a Gold Star donor, together providing an additional 20 gift cards to help us reach our goal. Thanks to their special gifts and other donors, we reached our goal of 75 gift cards, matching the number given last year. Pastor Tatum's outcry in 2020 about economic and health challenges and the 76104 zip code was instrumental in the Fort Worth Star-Telegram's reporting through a series of articles that put a spotlight on the need for focused leadership and development of urgent strategies to improve quality of life conditions in this neighborhood. A UT study revealed that Tarrant County residents living in the 76104 zip code had the lowest life expectancy of any zip code in the state of Texas. Over the past two years, in response to multiple challenges magnified by the COVID-19 pandemic, Pastor Tatum has collaborated with local, state, and federal organizations to secure much-needed resources to address issues such as food deserts, lack of transportation limiting access to jobs, insufficient health care options, and more. Recently, he expanded his church's definition of ministry by initiating a clinic without walls, by converting his church into an accessible facility within the 76104 neighborhood for the distribution of PPE supplies, testing, and COVID-19 vaccinations, as well as monoclonal antibody infusions for residents infected by the virus. His innovative and courageous efforts have resulted in thousands of Southside residents receiving assistance. The 2021 Community Partner Award goes to Pastor Tatum. We have many partners in workforce, and today we would like to highlight three of them. The Women's Center has worked with Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County to ensure services to customers continued regardless of the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. The Women's Center assisted us with the build-out training cohorts to meet the immediate needs of our mutual customers. Once the model was developed and piloted, the Women's Center continued to meet with Workforce Solutions to staff and our shared customers to ensure their success in the initiative developed. The Women's Center has been an integral piece to prepare Tarrant County residents for employment. Our first 2021 Workforce Partner Award goes to the Women's Center. Goodwill North Central Texas has been a valuable partner to Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County for many years. During the pandemic, the Youth Job Skills Initiative was introduced. This initiative allows for disadvantaged young adults to have the opportunity to earn information on industry-recognized skills certificates or credentials. Some of the certificates and credentials they earned were forklift certification, accounting with QuickBooks, Child Care Associate, Microsoft Office Suite, Food and Customer Service Training. The young adults that are enrolled in Youth Job Skills are co-enrolled in our program. These young adults participate in a program called E-Squared, Education and Employment, which is a program that targets high school dropouts. The young adults that are enrolled in this program are provided high school equivalency for three hours and are provided paid internship opportunities the other part of the day, Monday through Friday. Once the young adults pass two parts of their high school equivalency, they are able to enroll in training youth job skills. 
Due to COVID-19, they had to pivot, and all the trainings were 100% virtual, and Goodwill North Central Texas continued to provide excellent service that ensured Tarrant County young adults were prepared for employment and or post-secondary education. So far, Goodwill has 59 participants enrolled, 19 participants receiving a high school diploma or equivalent, 27 participants have obtained employment, and 47 are enrolling in post-secondary education. The second 2021 Workforce Partner Award winner, Goodwill North Central Texas. Pathfinders has been a valuable partner for many years. This partnership has afforded workforce solutions for Tarrant County and Pathfinders the ability to partner on many projects to serve the residents of Tarrant County that were unemployed or underemployed. Currently, Pathfinders is providing mentoring services to our TANF populations and recently was challenged with expanding to young adults 16 to 24. Anyone that has served young adults knows that this comes with its own set of challenges. Pathfinders didn't back down and immediately came up with strategies to provide mentoring services. Pathfinders provide several services that are benefit to the community. Some of those services are financial literacy, adult mentoring, and community resources, just to name a few. The service that Pathfinders provides goes beyond mentoring and really works to move families out of poverty. Our final 2021 Workforce Partner Award goes to Pathfinders. Next, we like to highlight three of our exciting apprenticeship programs and partners that have helped make them a success. Fort Works is a collaboration between Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County, Tarrant Area Food Bank, Taste Project, and the Culinary School of Fort Worth. It is a new collaborative initiative for adults interested in careers in the food service industry. The 16-week program provides training on the job learning and the fundamentals of food preparation. The program offers five courses per year and accepts up to 16 apprentices per course. Upon completion, apprentices are equipped with employment and fast casual restaurants, food manufacturing, and institutional food service operations, such as hospitals, hotels, and corporate cafeterias. The Fort Works program to date has Five cohorts have been funded. The sixth is in recruitment as we speak. 21 total clients accepted into the program. 17 have graduated. Eight are employed. The average wage for those employed is $15.50 an hour. This has also been valuable to further connecting our mission with the community. The first 2021 Apprenticeship Partner Award goes to the Fort Works program. We have asked the following organizations to join us. In partnership with North Texas automobile dealers, Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County created a pre-apprenticeship program for graduating high school seniors in the automotive technical programs at local ISDs. The pre-apprenticeship program is a work-based learning model that provides the setting for students to learn manufacturing standards and service protocols directly from the service team at local dealerships. Pre-apprentices work alongside dealership staff, giving them the opportunity to forge relationships in the workplace and grow their skill sets in the automotive industry. Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County pays the pre-apprentices wages through our young adult program and offers other services to ensure success, such as work supplies and transportation assistance. This pilot program began in spring 2021 with three high school automotive graduates from Arlington ISD, Birdsville ISD, and Crowley ISD. 
Each student has completed their base level automotive service excellence certifications through their high school career and technology program and is committed to moving into Tarrant County College's registered apprenticeship program. We have partnered with over seven automobile dealers in Tarrant County to host these pre apprentice students. Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County, through our internship program, pays each pre apprentice $12 an hour. We have two apprentices based at Classic Buick in Arlington and one placed at Huggins Honda in North Richland Hills. All three of the pre-apprentices are registered in Automotive Technician Apprenticeship Program at Tarrant County College for the spring 2022 semester. This tuition will be paid for by Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County as part of the program. The feedback received from pre-apprentices has been great. They really enjoyed working alongside industry experts and learned so many new skills and processes in the automotive field. The participating dealerships have been very pleased with the quality of candidates through the program. They are prepared, ready to work, and learn while on the job. We are excited to grow and expand this pre-apprenticeship program and will be actively recruiting graduating automotive technician students from local Tarrant County ISDs in spring 2022. The second 2021 Apprenticeship Partner Award winner, North Texas Automobile Dealers. In 2018, work began to create the first in Texas Department of Labor Registered Early Education Apprenticeship Program. Led by Campfire First Texas, Workforce Solutions for Tarrant County joined Tarrant County College, Chiltern State University, and Texas Association for the Young Children Teach Early Childhood to make this come to fruition. In fall of 2020, the first cohort began. A year and a half later, the impact of this workforce development for early childhood educators continues to grow. So far, the total enrolled in early education apprenticeship is 52. Total retained or percentage retained is 71%. Total graduates are four of four eligible for graduation after year one. The total graduates now enrolled in higher education is 25%. The total on pace to graduate this summer is 20 Tarrant County College, together with Camp Fire First Texas Early Education Apprenticeship Program, was recently awarded a $120,000 Texas Workforce Commission Apprenticeship Texas Expansion Grant to train early childhood educators. Funding will support the ongoing partnership, which provides early education teachers working with children aged 0 to 5 a pathway for educational and career advancement to earn increased wages and college credit for professional certifications. This grant will help strengthen and expand Campfire First Early Education Program in two fundamental areas provide an apprentice navigator to TCC to administer the grant and review reports prepared by EEAP director for TWC. TCC will also audit U.S. Department of Labor RAPIDS reporting system reports. Expand access of the program to 60 apprentices. This is triple the number of apprentices registered during 2020, the inaugural year of the program. Our final 2021 Apprenticeship Partner Award goes to Campfire First Texas. Our Adult Education and Literacy Program provides education and training services through our four subcontractors as part of the Tarrant County Adult Education and Literacy Consortium. The service providers with funding and student target numbers are Arlington ISD, Arlington Public Library, Fort Worth ISD, and Tarrant County College. The services include English as a Second Language, Adult Basic Education, High School Equivalency, internationally trained professionals English as a second language, and workplace literacy. 
Additionally, AEL provides support classes and trainings that lead to an industry-recognized credential for an in-demand occupation in industries in Tarrant County. Due to COVID-19 and the continued pandemic, it has been a challenge to continue AEL services due to the lack of technology in the home. We are currently providing approximately 175 remote classes to meet demand and will be serving approximately 4,600 participants by June 30th, 2022. Thanks to funding and support provided by Tarrant County, the AEL program was able to purchase 700 laptops that are serving approximately 15% of the participants receiving AEL services in Tarrant County. These laptops benefit participants in our AEL classes, workplace literacy for employees to engage in curriculum at home or outside of the work hours. Participants in the Young Adult Vocational Academy working their industry credentials and help to assist with digital literacy classes focus on acceleration of digital skills. Participants have access to AEL curriculum through an online platform to assist with keeping them engaged in between classes. Due to the funding from Tarrant County, we were able to address the need for access to technology and increase the digital literacy instruction to address the technology needs for success and to close the gap on the digital divide. The laptop loaner program we will be able to put into place with the resources provided to us by Tarrant County is an invaluable resource to our AEL students. The 2021 AEL Partner Award goes to Tarrant County. This past year, during the pandemic, child care associates developed resources and webinars to assist child care providers who were most in need of critical assistance during this unprecedented time. Child Care Associates is one of the largest child development nonprofits in North Texas and has served more than half a million young children in the past 53 years. Head Start Deputy Director Jessica Oswald and Ashley Flowers developed a system to where family engagement advocates could complete an electronic form that would populate to a spreadsheet that could be organized by the zip code for delivery assignments. They then recruited volunteers to deliver those items to families in need. The Baby Batch Express program was developed to provide families with consistent items such as diapers, wipes, formula, and baby food five days a week. They made deliveries to 350 non-duplicated families. These items included one case of diapers every two to four weeks, one case of wipes every two months, baby food, and a case of non-perishable food. Their food distribution came about after realizing that the additional cost of providing food for children throughout the week would normally deplete SNAP and WIC benefits too quickly. Child Care Associates established a partnership with the Tarrant Area Food Bank to be able to provide food to 200 to 500 families as well as the surrounding community. Each family received on average 30 pounds of food at each distribution. Some of those food items included non-perishable foods, milk, eggs, fresh produce, rotisserie chicken, and frozen or easy-to-prepare entree options. Child Care Associates has hosted 50 distributions, each serving 250 families and approximately distributing 375,000 pounds of food from 2020 through 2021. A new community collaboration developed between Z's Cafe to provide bagged lunches, gallons of chocolate milk, cases of fruits and yogurts, Boys and Girls Club, Presbyterian Night Shelter, Women's Center, and Catholic Charities were provided diapers and formula by Child Care Associates that were given to them by the Tarrant Area Food Bank. The 2021 Child Care Partner Award goes to Child Care Associates. <laughs> 